so as promised more progress and I finally finished the uh, layering of the uh, not blue straight bricks along here so this looks pretty nice and of course it's going to be gone for over here and um, I will be kind of um, mimicking this kind of rough look with the tiles and the little uh, trenches kind of along here not too many trenches maybe two more but a lot of this uh, kind of rough tile look with the studs I really do like that and I did do this uh, right here. I got these bricks because the, you know this is corner. Took that out, so I just have this right here with those bricks to kind of have that effect, which is pretty cool. And I went ahead and I um, I had a little bit or about this much that wasn't uh, filled with the plates, and I go went ahead and um, kind of um, fixed that. And there's just a little bit more, which well will be fixed. When at Brick Fair, I don't know um, how this is going to be displayed, but I do kind of want to have some uh, open some openings, so where people can, the you know, public can look inside, see maybe some of the cool stuff. Um, but I don't exactly know how that's going to go. Parts have been kind of limited uh, the past little bit, I'm trying to work with what I have in here and kind of along here. So some Brooklyn quarters will be uh, made in the next couple weeks. I bought some parts. From uh, Bricks and Minifigs in uh, Columbus, Georgia. I'm just gonna go ahead and get out some of this stuff. So I was uh, there for vacation because it's uh, la uh, currently uh, Labor Day weekend. It's past midnight, so it is Labor Day. So let's go ahead and get into what I got, the Bricks and Minifigs. So kind of a rip off, but it's eight bucks uh, for this container. I mean, compared to like, a minifigure, I mean, it's decent, um, the small pick a brick up at the Lego store is a better deal, though, I mean, but as you can see, I got a uh, minifigure plate, you know, tan pieces, uh, medium, um, well, like, dark flesh or whatever, cool pieces, we'll dump that out in a second, and we got, uh, just the Jar Jar Binks, this was $8, like, what the crap, I kind of regret buying it, but I'm not going to be there within 30 days of their policy to return it, so, that is okay. Let's go ahead and dump this out. Just, uh, there we go. You know, found some interesting pieces. Just, you know, like this clear brick. And this is uh, from the Power Miners. You know, it was actually pretty crowded in the store. So, um, but it wasn't too crowded. There wasn't that many people uh, shopping. There was a birthday party. So, you know, it's kind of hectic. And just got uh, some more arches because uh, I've been working on the design, which we will get into later this episode. Just uh, some, you know, tan pieces. Been looking at um, brick link for some more modified bricks, such like this. This bag's pretty cool, but uh, the jar jar right here, you know, pretty detailed. Um, the first jar jar ever, really. But it's, um, you know, I'll use it in the mock. Um, you know, it'll definitely be in here at Brick Fair, Alabama. So I've been testing out some designs and came up with this little thing. It's pretty basic. Uh, I got these curved bricks and a little bit of snot technique going on right here. There's this little line and uh, this would kind of go on like a corner of a building. All right, guys, that's gonna be about it for this uh, episode of Building Feed. Make sure you like the video. Make sure you tell me how do you like this episode. Uh, maybe some improvements for the uh, video or building. Make sure you subscribe.